Today we are going to discuss about how to add content page from master page in ASP.NET. In the previous episode we have seen how to add master page in ASP.NET web project. Please refer that. Now here we consider how to add content page from master page. For that let's open one solution. Here on my solution test website I have already added one master page main.master. Now I am going to add one content page with respect to this master page. For that right click on the master page, select add content page. This will add the content page with respect to this master page. If you can see the default name will be webform1.aspx. You can rename it with preferred one. Here I am renaming it as content page.aspx. If you can see all other pages inside this aspx file are renamed it as content page.aspx. Now if you double click on this content page, you can see only content placeholders are available for editing. In master page we have created two content placeholders and in time page you will get only those two content placeholders for editing. Here you can see I am going to develop a new page with respect to this master page and child page. So as you can see in the master page outside the content placeholder we have placed one text welcome to technomark.in this is from master page some br slash also now on the content page instead the content placeholder I have placed another text this is from child page now let's see how it's looking in runtime yes now it's okay you can see this is from master page and this is from child page. By this way we can make child page from the master page in ASP.NET web application. Thank you guys for watching this video. Please visit technomark.in for more information.